Albinos are cursed. Albinos possess magical powers. Albinos are ghosts, and having sex with an albino person can cure you of HIV. Right? Wrong. This video will debunk five dangerous myths about albino people. Before we proceed, please give this video a like. This will help spread the message by getting this video recommended to a wide audience. On to myth number one, albinism is a curse. This is a widespread belief that has caused immense harm to albino individuals and their families. Many albino babies in Tanzania don't live to see their first birthday as they are thrown away immediately after birth. After giving birth to children with albinism, some mothers even have to do some ritual ceremonies to be cleansed from that curse. Some believe they are ghosts, and when you get a ghost in African circles, it means it's a curse. Others think they did something bad and God punished them. That the child was from demonic powers and they will not believe that they are human beings. They think they are spiritual beings. For those to survive, life is a daily struggle as they come face to face with stigma and a constant danger looming over their lives. It's important to understand that albinism is not a curse, but a naturally occurring variation in human genetics. Myth number two, albino people have supernatural powers. While some beliefs are benign, other superstitions have proven more dangerous. In Tanzania, witch doctors have spread the myth that individuals with albinism and their body parts have superpowers. Fishermen use nets woven from albino hair, believing these nets will catch more fish. Witch doctors use body parts from afflicted individuals as an ingredient in potions or as a trinket for jewelry to bring good fortune and wealth to those who possess them. Another myth is that when you drink the blood of a person with albinism, you will have supernatural powers and very good luck. The Office of the UN High Commissioner for Human Rights, the UN agency that deals with human rights issues, purported in 2016 that albino hunters sell an entire human corpse for up to $75,000, while an arm or a leg could fetch about $2,000. Albino people do not possess any supernatural abilities. They are simply human beings with unique physical characteristics. Myth number three, albinism is due to a lack of sun. Albino children find themselves placed outside to become accustomed to the sun, and adults with albinism are encouraged to work outdoors as frequently as possible, further increasing their risk of skin cancer. Studies estimate that the majority die of skin cancer between the ages of 30 and 40, and this is due to sun exposure. It is important to realize that individuals with OCA lack melanin and are therefore susceptible to the harmful effects of solar ultraviolet radiation. Myth number four, 